She says, I'm trying to have a baby and want to go the natural route, but my friends and family are pressuring me to do in vitro fertilization. Can you please explain the potential issues with using hormones? I heard it can increase the chance of cancer. Is this correct, and if so, why? Well, number one, the biology uh, that we, we spoke about um, 21 minutes ago, where hormones are the language that cells communicate with one another with. Now, if you have a good hormonal balance in the body, the language is very clear. It's like me speaking to you and you understanding what I'm saying and then responding to that. If you don't have uh, hormonal balance, if you're putting the wrong hormones or too many hormones or too little hormones, too much estrogen, whatever it may be, when the language is being spoken between one cell and another, all at once it becomes a language the other cell doesn't understand or recognize. When cells are not given direct, clear commands, they tend to start to mutate, spin in the wrong direction, and many times it ends up being a disease we call cancer. So I hope that gives all of the listeners a picture. Uh, we have seen this firsthand in a clinical setting because uh, boatloads of young women who have attempted to have children uh, show up here at some later date with cancer. The very unfortunate ones during their second or third attempt show up here with cancer. And it's usually those parts of the body that are most hormonally sensitive, like uh, cervical areas, like ovaries, like breasts, uh, that are the victims of this exceptionally, exceptionally high amount of it. You should also look into the real statistics of how many women fail with in vitro fertilization. You also all look into the health of the child and why now we're having multiple births where people are having six and seven and eight babies because it confuses the egg and the sperm so much literally it starts to split and uh, there's a chromosomal DNA uh, negative that comes from that. Uh, I know the desire to have a child is overwhelming and biological and I know that uh, it is tempting to do something that appears to be so brilliant and scientific, but I can't say anything good about it other than the fact that if you do it naturally and it doesn't work, there's an awful lot of very worthy children that need to be adopted. 